Folks, thanks for joining us here today. My name is John Dubas with Premier Marketing, and we'll be spending the next 45 minutes to an hour or so discussing how Emeritus's dental programs can help drive the growth of your practice and your agency and become a profitable additional revenue stream for you while covering the needs of your prospects and clients. Today's presentation is being recorded, and that link to that recording, along with a copy of the presentation itself, will be sent to everyone who has RSVP'd for today's uh, presentation. We will make certain that uh, the information is sent to you on a timely basis and appreciate your time with us here today. Uh, the software system for this webinar does have both a question and a chat box. We'd ask that you ignore the chat box and put your questions in the uh, questions box, and we'll make certain that we get you an answer for those. In many circumstances, those answers come as a course through the course of the presentation itself, but we'll review at the end to make certain that we make, get you the information um, that you're looking for. Much of the collateral information that we refer to through the course of the presentation will be sent to you as well. For those of you that um, aren't familiar with our organization, we'll start with a little bit of a level set about Premier Marketing. We are a national marketing organization founded in 1968. That's part of the Integrity Marketing Platform. We have offices across the country and act as an insurance wholesaler, providing insurance services to the public through independent agents such as yourself. We offer that service through contracts with you at the highest possible commission levels with recruiting contracts available to those who qualify. As I mentioned, being founded in 1968, we recently celebrated a milestone in our history, our 50th anniversary, and we feel that's quite an accomplishment for what started as a small family agency in rural Nebraska that's grown into one of the largest marketing organizations of its type. We do so through a full insurance portfolio that includes a gambit of the Medicare programs, including Medicare Advantage and Medicare Supplement Health programs, and the standalone Part D prescription drug programs. But we also have a full portfolio of life insurance and annuities, final expense products, free need programs, long and short term care programs, disability income plans, and ancillary benefits, much like what we'll discuss today in the dental vision hearing arena but also critical illness and cancer programs and hospital indemnity plans. When you look in the Medicare Advantage area, we have all the national carriers for you, along with many of the strong regional providers that can make a difference for you in your market and carry that same philosophy over into the PDP arena where those national carriers are available to you, to you through our organization. When you speak of Medicare supplements, we have a large selection of programs available to you, including a number that are very hot right now, fairly newly introduced, and offer a support system to help make this a profitable part of your business as well. We speak to these different segments of Medicare because regardless of the choice that someone has of their base coverages, ancillary programs really do serve a purpose and fill the need. And as you see in these programs, we have the leaders in each of the categories, including our guest speaker for today that we'll get to in just a moment. When you look at the Medicare market overall, you see a very large number of folks that are available for us to market to. But if you look at that base just on age, because everyone speaks to you about the baby boomers turning 65, the silver tsunami, um, 10,000 people a month turning 65 each month, uh, one every 10 seconds, however you want to look at it. If you take that as your base market, you're actually leaving out a good portion of the folks that you can address these programs to. And one of them, you, you almost have to take a step back because just because someone turns 65, it doesn't necessarily mean that they're all going to access their benefits through Medicare right away. About 10 to 12 percent of the folks don't. But you have about a sixth of the Medicare population that is under the age of 65. And so we have a much bigger market with the Medicare-based needs being, I mean, their medical base 
medical needs being based on Medicare coverage. That's important today in our discussion because the ancillary products many times are available to folks under the age of 65, most generally. And by offering a varied portfolio of products, we're handling the needs on a more general basis for our prospects and clients because they enter into base coverages with challenges with their health. Two thirds of them have three plus chronic illnesses and some of them have some challenges, well, most half of them with the pocketbook as well. So by offering programs that help them budget properly for needs that they're going to encounter, we're being of great service to them, handling their overall situation, but also adding to the revenue streaming into our organizations as well. It's interesting to note how the ancillary programs are a part of any of the options that a person has as they enter into Medicare. Because if we think about it, one of the first choices that some folks have is, am I going to pick up Part B? It's optional. They don't have to. If they do, how are they going to cover the shortfalls in those coverages? Um, you have some challenges with folks being then financially able to not only handle the overall cost of what might happen to them because of gaps, but also an ability through these programs to help budget for it. So even if they go the traditional Medicare route and perhaps add in the Part D for the drugs and a standardized Medigap policy, there are some base needs that aren't covered in just healthcare. And that same thing applies over on the Medicare Advantage side, though some of the ancillary benefits may be happening or available to them on a limited basis, they have to look at their own situation and see what additional help they may need. So regardless of the base choices that someone has with their coverages, our discussion today is of value to them. When we look at how folks coming into Medicare are handling their choices for that base when they first become involved in the system, notice I didn't say age in completely, you're seeing kind of an even split on the base medical between Medicare Advantage and MedStop, and then you have a portion that appear that they're not doing anything at all. It's not necessarily the case. They may have coverage through retirement programs, through Medicaid, through uh, the VA, whatever it may happen to be. But once again, in each of these categories, we can offer a program to them that helps them regardless of their base situation. And sometimes when we deal with Medicare, we need a translator. So if you need help with some of these acronyms or if you'd like a copy of one of these programs that help you determine what the heck an AI-AN is, you'll have that information available to you. It'll come as part of the follow-up uh, to today's presentation. But when we speak specifically about dental coverage, let's look at some of the reasons why it's of a need. When you look at the base coverages that folks have when they're on Medicare, two thirds of them don't have med uh, dental coverage and they don't have coverage even though they say they're gonna need it and they know that it's coming, but they don't actually do much about it. So we've got a market there that we can really help engage. It's also important to note that one of the main reasons why folks don't go to the dentist is the cost, and these programs directly address that. And you can see that that may be, the lack of coverage may be one of the reasons why folks aren't going to the dentist even though they need it. And even if they have some coverage, they need additional help with those expenses. When we look at the Medicare and You book, on page 49, it tells us specifically what Medicare does and doesn't cover. And that's reinforced by studies like this one cited from the Kaiser Family Foundation, which you'll have an attachment that has that whole study to it on part of the follow-up. It tells us that they need help in the dental uh, situation. Because once again, two thirds of them don't have that help. And even if they're in an MA plan that does offer some benefit, in many circumstances, it's not enough. It's also an area where even the duals don't have all the assistance that they need in covering dental coverage. So we have other side effects, so to speak, of how dental can help with other screenings. And you'll, it's amazing to see how many people have 
discovered other challenges to their health by vi visiting their dentist. So what we have today is a guest speaker that's going to help us discuss one of the top dental programs available in the market, if not the top dental program, and that's Emeritus. So we had the pleasure of having Taylor Davis with us here today to help us walk through the offerings through Emeritus and how this can positively affect the uh, outcomes for both our agency and ourselves as agents, but even more to the prospects that we serve. So at this time, I want to turn control of the helm over to Taylor and uh, ask him to take it away. Taylor? Awesome. Perfect. Thanks, John. I appreciate it. And uh, those stats were, were fantastic. And, and while you're going over it, I, I don't have it in this slide, but even with regards to uh, the, the senior uh, space uh, and, and primarily retirees, I was just reading a study the other day that 71% of retirees intend to keep or add dental coverage um you know that's a that's a large number you know that's seven out of ten of your clients that you're going out to talk about about medicare you know a lot of them like you kind of went over don't understand that hey traditional medicare doesn't offer dental revision and even med, uh, medicare advantage very 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 little amount of dental uh dental envision so uh, when you are out there talking to your clients especially in the retiree space you know, that's a, that's a big stat to know that primarily most of your clients are looking for dental and vision. So, so thanks again, John, for, for all that information. Um, again, my name is Taylor Davis. I'm the regional managing director here at Emeritus. Um, I want to say thanks for, for taking the time. I know it's a busy schedule for you. Um, we're, we're creeping up on AEP. It's right around the corner. You're probably all getting ready for that. But I do want to say thanks for joining and, and talk a little bit about dental and vision why it's important to add to your product portfolio, specifically uh, how Emeritus stands out from the crowd through our no waiting periods, uh, large network, product simplicity, ease of enrollment, and much, much more with, that I'll go over here in this uh, webinar. Before kind of getting started, I'd like to go over why dental envision. Um, why add it to your product portfolio? We do a lot of research um, when it comes to dental and vision. As you'll see, it's, it's our primary focus here at Emeritus. But the demand, again, 71% of retirees are looking for dental and vision. With regards to dental and vision, it's a product that is talked about within a group of people. It's not like home insurance or, or car insurance that they're purchasing to, to not to use. Dental and vision, they're purchasing because hey, they probably need to go in as soon as tomorrow with our product with no waiting periods, next day effective dates, they can. They're going to talk to their neighbors, their friends, um, whoever it might be. Those referrals will start coming in because they're going to say, wow, Mrs. And Miss, uh, Mr. or Mrs. Agent saved me X amount of dollars by signing me up for Emeritus Dental. I went in the next day um, and had a great experience. Uh, my, my dentist was in network. Uh, just a great overall experience. And those referrals, just as a simple product as dental envision, will start coming in. Persistency. As you guys know, the more products you have with that client, the better persistency you're going to have. It's adding value to your client's life day one. That's really our go-to-market strategy when we launch uh, products, even all the way down to our old products that we used to have. We're, we're, we're adding value to your client's life day one. Again, with no waiting periods, next day effective dates. That's adding real value that's saving them money day one. And really, that just adds to your reputation. It's a great way to, um, to talk about uh, insurance that they're going to use. Um, and, and again, it, it goes right back to that referral base. The, the more uh, products you have with this client, the more they're going to talk to their friends about it. Uh, the products that they can use day one, they're going to talk to friends about it that referral base will grow with a product like Dental and Vision. So skipping over to why Emeritus. Uh, we know there's a lot of carriers out there. John hinted at it. I would say we're, we're probably the leading carrier when it is in the, in the Dental and Vision space. And I, I attribute that to our expertise. Our, our main focus is Dental and Vision at Emeritus. Um, we're not a, a medic, medical carrier that said, you know what, let's add you know Dental and Vision as a as a second product to our product portfolio. Dental and Vision has been our um, go-to product for a very long time. 
And really when we launch new products, like I said before, we look at providing that economic value and how we do that is through product simplicity. We want to try to make this product as simple as possible, but the best product out there at the same time. We want to try to mirror that group side as well, just so when someone is maybe retiring or, you know, they've been in a group dental space for, you know, X amount of years, we want them to understand, oh, wow, it, it works pretty similar to, to what I've had the past, you know, 25, 30 years. Our product is 18 and over, so there's no max age to our product. So again, product simplicity and ease of enrollment is another one. We want this product to be uh, simple to understand, and then we want that enrollment process to be uh, short. You can get easily under three minutes. You can get through our enrollment process, and I'll go over it here at the end of this uh, webinar. And really, last thing is network. We'll dive deep into the Emeritus Network um, how our network works, the negotiated rates, and so on. I'll, I'll talk about it throughout this webinar about being tied for first place. I would always say product, you have to have a great product and you have to have a great network. You can't have either or. Without, without a great network, it doesn't really matter what kind of product you have and vice versa. So I think network is huge when you're talking about dental and vision. Luckily, with our products, you can go in network or out of network. In our experience, 30 years in the senior dental space, we're hovering around that 350 million in force business on the uh, Prime Star product, the one that we'll go over today. Overall, here at Emeritus, we have about, oh goodness, 2.3 billion in revenue. Out of that 2.3, about 1.9 of it is dental. So again, it's one of our focuses. It is our main focus here at Emeritus. Nationwide coverage. I'm happy to say that we are in all 50 states. This helps you, the agent, not have to switch from different products, um, not have to understand three, four, five different dental and vision products. You can focus in on Emeritus because we are in all 50 states. You will see Washington, Missouri, Pennsylvania, New York, New Hampshire, and Maryland. Those are just on our previous plan. Uh, those six states just haven't been approved for our new plan that we'll go over today. Um, but those six states are still on our Prime Star Advantage Plus product. Texas, Illinois, and Connecticut, uh, very slight state specifics there. Illinois and Connecticut, uh, what we changed there is on our old products, we used to have a waiting period in those two states. It was the only two states out of all 50 that had a waiting period. And uh, with this new product, we switched over uh, and had Illinois and Connecticut that does no longer have a waiting period, but the day one coinsurance levels are, m are much higher than, than normal. Um, so I'll, I'll tell you the differences here in a little bit, but I really just want to hone in on that we are in all 50 states. Prime Star Protect. Uh, so we launched Prime Star Protect, oh goodness, in September of 2019. We launched about 34 states, and then uh, March of this year, we launched 10 more. So all in all, we have 44 states with Prime Star Protect. Again, those six other ones are on Prime Star Advantage Plus. Uh, but we're going to focus on Prime Star Protect today. So, with regards to Prime Star Protect, preventative, that's exams, cleaning, bite wing x rays, sealants, covered 100% day one. And when I mean day one, we have next day effective dates. So, you're talking to your client today, tomorrow they can go in and we will pay 100%. Basic, filling, simple extractions, 65% day one. Okay, again, no waiting periods. Next day effective date, they can go as soon as tomorrow, filling simple extractions, 65% day one. Major root canals, crowns, bridges, dentures, and yes, even implants, 20% day one. So again, you're talking with your client, and, and they're saying, you know, I've been needing to go in and get some crown work done. Great. You can go in tomorrow at 8 a.m. and go get some crown work done. That's how soon they can go in. Um, so again, 20% day one ortho, uh, it's for uh, under age 19, but it's 15% day one. Uh, benefit year deductible is $50. That does not go towards preventative. It's just for basic major and ortho. So really the, the deductible is way for preventative. So in year two, again, 100% day one on preventive, basic 65%. Year two is 80%. So on anniversary, if you were to sign them up today, 2021, they'll jump up to 80%. Major, 20%. Again, day one, 50% on anniversary, it jumps up to. Ortho, same thing, it jumps up to 50% on anniversary. Something I want to circle back with with this deductible, starting July 1st, 
through December 31st, we are waiving the deductible for everything except ortho. Ortho will still have the deductible, but uh, for preventive basic major, no deductible. So another great talking point, especially leading into AEP, talking with your client, saying, hey, if you need to go, great. You're going to save an additional $50 because you don't have to pay the deductible. We're waiving it. It is our uh, COVID-19. Uh, we want to try to help as much as possible. Uh, so we are waiving the deductible starting July 1st through December 31st of 2020. Benefit your maximum or one or 2,000. So again, as you can see, we, we try to have that product simplicity. You know, we want to try to mirror the group side as much as possible. And we want it to be easily easy to understand, but at the same time, one of the best products in the marketplace. So again, tomorrow, they go in, preventative 100% day one, basic 65%, major 20% ortho for um, under age 19, 15%. I'll say it again though, July 1st through December 31st, 2020, we are waiving the deductible. Member flexibility, along with that product simplicity, we want member flexibility. Like I said before, network is super important to have, but we also know that not every dentist is gonna be on our network. So we want that, that member flexibility to be like, you know what, I've been going into this dentist for the past 30 years, uh, but for some rare occasion, they're not in the Emeritus network, that's okay. They can go out of network as well. So let's focus a little bit on the network. We pay claims at negotiated rates. Right now we're averaging about 34% on negotiated rates. And again, that 34% has nothing to do with the co-insurance. This is why I say network and product are tied for first place. Without even talking about the product itself, you're already saving that client roughly 34%. Any dentist, if they go out of network, we pay claims at 80th UNC. So that's pretty much, if you look at a specific zip code, we look at a specific zip code and look at what eight out of 10 dentists charge in that zip code. And we'll base our uh, payment off of that. So to give you an example, if they were to go in tomorrow to an out of network dentist, and uh, they get some crown work done, and let's say that dentist charged them $1,400 for that crown work. Well, once we, we receive the claim, we look at 80th UNC. Let's just say the 80th UNC is $1,300. We would base our 20% day one coverage, because crown is a major, off of that $1,300 and not that $1,400. So they can be balanced billed. Um, a good route to look for 80th UNC is fairhealthconsumer.org. Great website. I use it all the time. You'll see a, an example here in just a little bit when I show how much money they can save uh, day one with our product. But fairhealthconsumer.org, you can go on there, type in a zip code. You can look up everything dental, and you can see what 80 of UNC is in, a, in that specific zip code. That'll give a good idea to show them, hey, here's what 80 of UNC charges. Like if they say, you know, I don't feel like I need um, dental because, you know, I can go in tomorrow and pay, you know, $1,300 for a crown. You know, it's great, but with ours, you know, you save 34% by going in network and you throw in a 20% co-insurance. Uh, so there's a lot of things that go into it, but that website is fantastic just to look at 80 at UNC. So why is network important? So some of the values are lower premiums. So if you go with uh, PrimeStar Protect Network, you're going to have a lower premium than just PrimeStar Protect. They are contracted fees, again, negotiated rates. We're anywhere from 25 to 50% on those negotiated rates, uh, but right now we're averaging about 34%. There's no balance billing when it comes to network, just like I went over with that 80th UNC, when if they charge 1,400, but the 80th UNC is 1,300, they can balance bill that $100. No claims forms when it's in network. All of our network providers uh, do it electronically. So you don't have to worry about any of that submission. Um, and then again, this great customer service when it comes to network because everyone knows how everything works um, and they, they work with our claims team all the time. So when it comes to uh, Emeritus Dental Network, uh, we're growing pretty rapidly, um, but it's strategic growth. I'll say that because easily you'll look at this, right now we're sitting at about 557,000 access points. We could easily be at, you know, 900,000 access points if we wanted just to, you know, get with every uh, dental uh, provider out there. But we want to team up with those providers who give the best negotiated rates. 
again, right now we're averaging 34%. I think it's a super important to talk about when it comes to access points. Um, access points is the brick and mortar location on where a member can seek dental services. So the 557,000 access points, that's brick and mortar locations. And inside of those access points, there's 127 unique providers. Again, we're constantly growing. Just in the past year, we've grown about 70,000. But again, with the strategic growth, we want to make sure that we're partnering with those providers who give the best negotiated rates. So here's an example of, of how much money can be saved um, with the Marriage's Dental and Vision. So like I went over before, uh, beginning of this webinar, we want to provide the most economic value possible, especially with a product like Dental and Vision. So this is the zip code in Minnesota. Uh, same thing, I went to fairhealthconsumer.org. I looked up uh, in this zip code, what's the 80th UNC uh, for a crown? In this Minnesota zip code, it's just over $1,200. So again, if they were to go in tomorrow, you know, they're probably going to pay somewhere around $1,200 if they have no insurance. Again, our network rate, because our negotiated rates are averaging about 34%, without even talking about the product, you're already saving them $500. Okay, so 809, and then off that 809, it's 20%. We pay 20% of that 809 off of the negotiated rate. So day one savings, you're saving them $580. Now, this is what I talk about providing economic value day one. That $580 will add to uh, some travel that they might want to do, some additional insurance. It's adding to your reputation. It's adding to referrals. They're going to talk about this. Saving $580 is a lot, of, a lot of money. And then once they talk about that to their friends, to their family, those referrals will start coming in. Again, it's a huge um, talking point to show them how much money they can save with a marriage dental and vision. Now, maybe they don't need to go in to get major work done uh, tomorrow or even this year, maybe next year when it, when it bumps up to 50%. So same thing, we'll take that network rate, 809 times 50%, we're saving them $822. So whichever way you look at it, if they go in tomorrow, we're providing economic value. If they go in a year from now, we're still providing economic value those referrals will continue to come in because they're always going to talk about it. Again, Dental and Vision is a product that they're going to use. It's not a product that they hope that is not going to be used. They're going to use it and they're going to save a ton of money. Uh, John went over this already a little bit, but uh, cross-selling with Medicare is super easy, especially with Dental and Vision. Um, as mentioned before, traditional Medicare, um, a lot of clients think going into it, that, hey, traditional Medicare, it offers dental and vision. As you guys know, it does not. Um, also with Medicare Advantage, um, you know, there are some out there that give, you know, very little benefits. But the great thing is, hey, if they go in a Medicare Advantage plan that does have some dental and vision plans, fantastic. Fantastic. Great thing about Emeritus is we do not coordinate benefits. So you can use both. Okay, that's another great talking point. But, but John went over it. Use the scope of the appointment form. Right, you got to use it anyway. Have one that has dental and vision on it. Medicare and you guidebook page 49. What's not covered? Top three things on there number one, dental. Number two is actually dentures, which great, you knock those two out of the park with, with dental. And then number three is vision, which we'll go over here in just a little bit. So, super easy product to talk about. Um, the scope of appointment form already gives you that door to talk about it. And then that Medicare and you guidebook just adds to you know what's not covered when it comes to Medicare. So Prime Star Vision, um, I'm happy to say that we have both IMED and BSP. Again, along with that member flexibility on the dental side, we want that member flexibility on the vision side. We don't want um, someone to be like, okay, yeah, I, I got X dental, but I have to have IMED because that's the only one they have, or I have to go with BSP because that's the only one they have. We want that member flexibility. Maybe they've been going to IMED for a long, long time. And they're used to that. Fantastic. Or they can go with BSP. So um, great, great member flexibility with regards to choosing their vision plan. So Prime Star Select Vision, that's our iMed plan. We're looking at more like Lens Crafters, Pearl Vision, um, Target Optical. With regards to our iMed plan, our Select Vision, it's a little bit cheaper plan. And you'll, I'll show you the differences here in a little bit. But eye exam is $25. Frames and contact allowance is $130. Just to give you some of the things that are talked about the most. 
again, it's a little bit cheaper than VSP, just over $10 with regards to select vision, eye med. But the frequencies for an eye exam is every 12 months. Eyeglass lenses are contact and frames. It's once every two years. Okay, so again, $130 allowance, $25 exam payment, frequencies, exam every 12 months, eyeglass lenses are contact frames every two years. So now let's tr transition to VSP. Again, VSP is more like Costco, VisionWorks. They just added Walmart um, at the end of last year. And with regards to VSP, exam is $10. So again, you saw I met at 25, VSP is at 10. Frames and contact allowance is a $150 allowance. Again, IMED was 130. But again, it really depends on where they go. Hey, if they've been going to Target Optical for a long time, then I imagine IMED is what they're used to. And if they've been going to Walmart as of recently or Costco, then VSP might be the way to go. But then it also comes down to frequencies. So with VSP, it's once per year for all of this. IMED again was once per year for an exam and once every two years for eyeglass lenses or contact and frames. Okay, so vision is super easy when you're talking about dental and vision. Again, our, our dental product, Prime Star Protect, if you're in one of those other six states, Prime Star Advantage Plus. And then when it comes to vision, get that member flexibility. Depending on how often they need to get eyeglass lenses or contacts and frames, and how much they wanna pay and where they've been going. It really boils down to those three things when it comes to vision. So ease of enrollment, we've gone over our product, we got, we've gone over providing that economic value um, day one with no waiting periods, next day effective date, uh, large network, member flexibility. We want that ease of enrollment to be great as well. We know you've probably enrolled them in some sort of maybe Medicare Advantage, uh, maybe even life insurance, you know, currently right now. Um, so we want the dental and vision to be a, a simple enrollment process. And how we do this, is once you get contracted with us, and maybe you're already contracted uh, with us, you'll receive a personalized hyperlink. Now this personalized hyperlink is specific to you. It'll have your name on there. Um, all business is tied to you. So um, make sure when you do get contracted with us that you only use your hyperlink. Don't use our, our um, star.emeritus.com website use your hyperlink to enroll your clients. You can enroll, you can quote, you can do everything on your hyperlink. Just make sure you use yours. Again, this hyperlink, it's not a face-to-face -face sale. So you can put it on, if you have a website, um, copy and paste that URL link somewhere on your website. Have a lot of agents do that as well. Um, put it in your email, send it to your clients, however you wanna do it. Say, hey, I just got uh, Meredith Dental and Vision, maybe to um, a lot of your Medicare clients. There's a lot of ways to do this because it's not a face-to-face -face sale. It's a great opportunity. Again, quoting is easy when it comes to uh, Emeritus Dental and Vision. All we need is zip code because we're zip code rated. We're not age. Okay, so it's, if, if someone is 25 years old, if someone's 100 years old, they're going to have the same um, rate if they're in the same zip code. So again, zip code, who will be covered? insurance needs and coverage start date. Again, coverage start date as soon as tomorrow. Once you hit submit on that quote, there'll be four products that'll pop up. Again, I said product simplicity. We have one product, but there's four different choices. Okay, we have Prime Start Protect Network 1000. Again, that's Prime Start Protect Network and it's a 1000 benefit. And then you have Prime Star Protect Network 2000. It's our network product with a 2000 benefit. And then you have our Prime Star Protect 1000 and 2000. Again, that Prime Star Protect 1 and 2000, you can go in or out of network. If you go in network, you still get the negotiated rates. And if you go out of network, you'll get uh, the 80th UNC for your clients. Provider search. Um, if you're not contracted with us yet, and you want to take a look at our providers, go to star.emeritus.com backslash find a dentist. Again, that's star.emeritus.com backslash find a dentist. And it'll pop up with this page. You can, you can search by city, uh, state, or zip. And once you type that information in, it'll show all the providers. If you, if you click a 10-mile radius, a 50-mile radius, 
it'll show all the in-network providers nearby in that in that zip code. A question I always get is, okay, there's there's some providers in green and there's some in, in uh, black lettering. What do the ones in green mean? The ones in green just mean they, they pretty much have a higher than average negotiated rate. It's the most cost effective provider. So where this comes in handy is if you're talking to a client, maybe they just say, I don't care what provider I go to, but I wanna be in network. Then I would choose one of the ones in green because they do give a higher than average negotiated rate. Now the ones in black lettering, fantastic providers. Again, for anywhere from 25 to 50% on those negotiated rates, um, so any way you look at it, it's going to be a great network uh, for your client. Again, just a question I always get about the green. Once uh, you do submit all the information, again, credit card um, information, your age, you'll get a, you'll get an email, and then the policyholder will get an email. That's great when it comes to if you put your hyperlink on your website or if you sent it out to multiple clients to say, hey, look at this new product I have. Uh, you can fill it out and enroll, or I can help you through it. However you look at it, you're always going to receive an email when someone enrolls through your hyperlink. Policyholder will receive one too. It pretty much just says, hey, your ID card will come in the in the mail seven to 10 business days. Thank you for, for being a uh, an emeritus customer. And then yours says, thank you for the sale. Uh, so it's a, it's a great resource to use um, when it comes to that. Uh, again, you'll get it every time on that confirmation email. So again, what's in it for the agent? As we went over before, it's ability to sell 12 months out of the year. Dental Envision is a great product because you're just not limited to Medicare timeframe. And another great thing is you're part of that Medicare platform. You can talk about it during open enrollment. Referrals, leads. Again, I talked about it throughout this process about they're going to use this product. They're going to save a ton of money by getting Emeritus Dental and Vision. That'll help with leads and referrals. And again, if that's tomorrow, if that's a year down the road, either way you look at it, they're going to save a lot of money. And it's really re uh, remaining relevant. Um, there's a thing I always talk about with Blockbuster and, and how Hulu and Netflix came about. And, and you know, uh, Blockbuster just didn't really want to be, um, you know, in that Seen with Netflix and Hulu, and what did that do? That, that put them out of business. They, they weren't staying relevant. They weren't that one-stop shop anymore like Netflix and Hulu. Um, so you got to be that one-stop shop. Offer everything. You don't want that client to say, okay, great, I got Medicare, I got life insurance from you. Now I got to go to this other agent and get dental when that other agent could be talking about a different Medicare or life product to, to that client. Again, be that one-stop shop for that client. More product, better persistency you're going to have. And again, the goal at the end of the day is adding value to your client's lives. And with Emeritus Dental and Vision products, you're adding value day one. And again, that just adds to your reputation. So again, thanks again for joining. Um, I know it's busy. I tried to get through this as, as fast as I could and, and uh, go through all the information, um, especially with, with AEP coming around the corner. But John, I'd be happy to answer any of those questions that were, were asked. Thank you, sir. And one of the first ones deals with how do you cover periodontal cut cleanings and is there any ortho available to the senior market? Yeah, no ortho um, covered to the senior market, just, just 19 and under. Uh, it has been something we've looked at, uh, but just right now, uh, no. Okie dokie. And I think that's, you know, that's the a testament to your presentation uh, Taylor, because that's the only question that we had that popped up. So that yeah, works out. Well yeah, I know. <laughs> that's good. I know one of the ones I always get are, um, are that coordinate benefits. And again, I, I touched on it in the webinar. We do not coordinate benefits. Um, so it's a great talking point as well. Uh, but yes, if they do have any questions, John, I know you can reach me and, and there's my number and, and uh, email address that you'd be happy to, to reach out anytime. Be happy to help. Awesome. Cool. Well, I thank you for that. We'll tie up the presentation with just a few points on how offering Emeritus in partnership with Premier can make a difference to individuals and some of the individual agents and agencies and how our support can help them. And one of the first things are, is, I should say, an ease of contracting. Uh, Emeritus has a nice system 
the program we're showing you here today enables you to create an agent profile and store your information on there. It answers questions you find in the common contracts. So it makes an electronic process the carriers that participate in the system, and a whole bunch do, much easier for you. One of the things we also do is make certain that you not only fulfill contractual obligations to the carriers by carrying errors and admissions coverage, but we offer a program that allows you to do so at a discounted rate and covers you regardless of whom you contract with for different programs. And you'll note this one even covers different variable products, and that's not easy to find that coverage any longer. So it's a, a situation where this can help you as an independent agent make certain that you are protecting yourself as well as fulfilling contractual obligations to the carriers. We also help you keep your license in play by offering discounted continuing education through our association with WebCE. And since you are an independent agent and you create your own benefit package, we also help you access disability income programs through a modified guarantee issue product that gives you discounted rates where you also share in the commission and protect your income. Much as today's presentation is being recorded, we also record uh, the other programs that we offer, keep them in a library for you, and it gives you an opportunity to go to our website at premiersmi.com or to our YouTube channel and access past presentations that deal not only with product much as we've discussed today, but also different ways of marketing these programs to the public. One of the things that's very helpful is it gives you then access to that information 24 seven and enables you to stay up to date on different programs. We also give you access as a contracted agent to Premier, a free quoting tool powered by CSG that gives you an opportunity to easily add on coverages to your Medicare base health coverages as well. You'll notice that dental is a adjunct in this and by using this system, it preps that conversation as well. And it gives you the opportunity to also make use of the recently added electronic app process once you go in and get the uh, basics of the programs and add it on to your Medicare medical coverage as well. We offer similar systems for Medicare Advantage and PDP programs through our Medicare Center program. So you have a number of ways of being more efficient in collecting applications uh, across the board and do so in a compliant fashion, all at no cost to you as a contracted agent with our organization. Since many times programs that aren't MA or PDP, since their comp is maximum is dictated by the government, many carriers will offer different trips and incentives, and those will help you also qualify for Premier's producer convention. We put those in a singular place so they're easily accessible to you, so you're aware that you are getting full maximum compensation for your sales efforts. Our cruise this year was to be a our trip was to be a cruise from Miami to the Bahamas. That little thing called COVID-19 kind of changed a whole bunch of things in more ways than we will probably know for years. We also help you get in front of folks as well. And that includes providing a, I'm a friend of Ma Bell and I'm on a cold call for folks. Dental can be a real demand product. So that is an effective way of reaching out to the public through a list that's butted up against do not call and that's available to you at a limited cost or depending upon your contracting situation, no cost at all. And you can use it for cold call campaigns and for um, utilizing a mail program should you choose to do so. It gives you, however, an opportunity to take advantage of that tried and true marketing effort that will get you in contact with folks that are interested in the products that you offer. Keep in mind, you can't cold call for M MA or PDP, but you sure can for a product that you can market year round like Emeritus is a dental program. Having a program such as Emeritus is a dental program also gives you an opportunity to become a subject matter expert in your chosen target market as well. 
And that can work in conjunction with the retail marketing programs that come about. The Walmart selection is well underway for locations. We recently got this past week information on Anthem's program. So there are different carriers that are rolling out these programs and having a demand product like Dental can give you another way of taking care of your customers that you run across through retail. It also makes a great topic to discuss in seminar selling or webinar selling in the new world that we have here, uh, or accessing that information through centers of influence in the community, such as faith-based organizations. In the new normal, we'll still have the opportunity to present seminars and having Emeritus's dental program available as a topic for rotation in visiting with those organizations can make a big difference for you and your production overall. And then of course, one of the things that Taylor mentioned is the networks that are associated with this, these programs. So it's important for us to have relationships with the folks that actually deliver the services to the programs that we're offering. Dentists aren't marketed to nearly as heavily as perhaps doctors or specialists. And because of the way that they are more loosely handled within in the network itself, since you have a range of what can be charged with usual and customary versus the discounted, having programs for Emeritus that helps that doctor or that dentist, I should say, with their revenue stream and collections for their particular practice can make a huge difference, not only as to how you can generate leads, but also the reputation that you have in the community. There are times as well where different carriers will generate prospects and make them available to contracted agents. That's a reciprocal relationship in many cases where um, you are known to help a particular carrier. You're more front line as to getting those types of generated prospects. We see that more frequently during EEP with some of the MA and PDP carriers. But right now with a lot of the MA carriers offering uh, dual special needs programs, carriers actually have marketing programs set up for those dentists. And having Emeritus in your back pocket can make a big difference as to how successful you are in dealing with uh, additional carriers as well. We do also offer internet leads for our final expense and Medicare products. It can be a great opener for the Colombo close uh, as you complete a, a, an appointment and you hit the door. And by the way, who do you have your dental coverage with? Just that one simple little question can make a big difference and that can help you. We also help with a direct mail support. Even though it may be outdated in some folks' minds, it's still a very effective way of reaching the public, and we deeply discount the cost of mail campaigns through our preferred lead vendors based on production. It can help you set up a consistent system of reaching out to the public, and you know what? Handling mail that way, it's much like having an exercise program. If you only do it every now and then, what you normally feel is the pain. If you do it consistently, it improves your situation and helps you uh, overall as well. All this said and done, what we're looking to do is have an opportunity to earn your business. Yesterday, we did an overview of the different products that we offer at Premier and a way of using the portfolio to help you sell even more in your chosen niche market, knowing about Emeritus and the different ways that it can help you market and cover your prospects and clients can be very, very helpful for you. And we're asking for your partnership in that area. So once you determine that this is a good way of influencing the success of your agency, let's get that process underway and do as John Wayne said in the Cowboys, don't wait. Hey, we're burning daylight. Let's get her done. That said, you can reach any of us here at Premier through our toll-free number at 1-800-365-8208. Visit with your marketer about Emeritus and the possibilities it brings to you and the success that you would experience consistently by using the program. 
or visit us at our website at premiersmi.com. Keep in mind that we will be sending out follow-up to today's presentation, and we'll make certain that we get that to you in a timely fashion. That said and done, it appears that we have Taylor answered all the questions so far that have come through the system. If other ones pop up along the way, we'll make certain that we address those on an individual basis. We want to thank you for your participation in today's presentation. We realize your time is your most valuable asset. We appreciate the investment of a portion of that time with us here today. So that said and done, watch for the follow-up. We'll be discussing the possibilities we have with Premier and Emeritus moving forward. And until we speak with you again, we wish you good selling. Thanks so much, and we'll talk to you soon.